Hey, what's up you guys? It's Soph and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are doing what you guys have always asked and have requested many many times whenever I post a selfie on Instagram. So here it is. Today I will be showing you my everyday makeup routine. It's a simple five minute step and I only have about 20 minutes to get myself ready. So I already um, did my skincare and the you can check it out on my reels. I put them, it's the same thing every day anyways. Um, the only thing that I did differently is to put on um, sunscreen. So you put on whatever sunscreen that you feel comfortable in and that you like to use. We're gonna start by using the Glossier Primer Priming Moisturizer Balance. It's an oil control gel cream, but it's for hydration, but it's most it's a primer. So I'm just gonna see if this works. Am I a YouTuber now? <laughs> Anyways, um, only use a think about two pumps of that, like tiny tiny bit, little bit, and mostly on my T zone, cause um, or on my under eyes, cause that's where I am. Not I won't say driest, but that is where. I will be putting on my makeup. I'm gonna use the Rare Beauty um, foundation in 230N. It's a shade lighter than I'm used to, so I'm gonna be using it as concealer. I'm gonna look at myself at the screen if I'm, you know, looking back and forth. But I'm looking at the screen to as a mirror, basically. Put here. Here, 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 a little bit here, and down. I tend to avoid putting anything on my nose because it's where I'm oilier, oiliest. So I'm gonna blend it out using a beauty blender. It's not a beauty blender, it's a makeup sponge. I got this from Shara, so. By the way, I'm gonna have my mirror next to me anyway. By the way, I'm filming this on my phone, so quality is like phone quality, it's like meh. I don't have a camera. So every time you see like a video of me when I post, it's always filmed on my phone. Um, so the reason why I'm using the foundation as concealer is that because one, it's amazing. It's so lightweight that you can barely feel it, and two because it's um, my it's actually my concealer shade and not my foundation shade, so it would look very awkward if I put it all over my face because it's like five shades lighter. I'm just gonna use the. Contact calm contact the compact powder because my loose powder is finished. Something in my eye. Anyways, I'm gonna take a little bit on my sponge and press in under my eyes to set it. And you also feel what about your your um, forehead and your chin? I'm gonna be using a brush. So, to set all this up. Oh no, I didn't use my brush. It's okay. See, the best thing about uh, Rare Beauty is that it's, I can somehow still use it on top of um, powder. So, I'll be using the Rare um, Blush in Joy. It's super pigmented. So I'm just gonna put one here, one dot here, one dot here, and a tiny dot there. Just a tiny, just a tiny, tiny, tiny dot. Cause look at this. Okay, I look like a clown now, but I'm gonna use their brush and blend that in. Now I look like. You know, Rudolph. And blend it in. 
it literally it blends so well but it's also so pigmented that's what everybody says now i look like a clown but it's okay i was supposed to do this before i set my face but you know sometimes sometimes you accidentally do things Once that's done, I'm gonna bronze my face. I'm using this ratchet, disgusting um, Rimmel London bronzer in 004 Sunstar. And using this really big, big, fluffy, fluffy brush just to bronze up my face because I'm a bit pale. So I'm using this to bring color back in my face in using very big 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 brush okay now that my base is done i'm gonna move over to my brows so I just brush them out with a spoolie and this is what I've been doing like the past few days is using the Rare Beauty Brow Harmony Brow Gel and just use that and not fill them in at all because <laughs> this brow gel is amazing. It's tiny so it actually looks like you've done your brows without actually doing your brows and it's also tinted so you know. There's that. Okay, so that's two of my brows. For definition, in, for my eyes, my eyes are quite dark. I don't put anything on it. I use the Tarte Lit Tease Palette. It's the Amazonian Clay Eyeshadow Palette. It's a mini version and a very, very small brush. And I take the darkest brown, which is Heartbreaker a few times and put it over my top lid just to darken just to like achieve that smoky esque dark eye look I don't know what I'm saying but this is what I do when I don't feel like wearing eyeliner so my eyes are defined but it's not too puffed out. Anyways, I'm gonna take... I'm also get, taking whatever's left and I'm putting under my eyes. Just for a subtle... a subtle smoky eye without it being a smoky eye. Mascara, so curl your... my lashes. I say hello to YouTube. Say hello. Okay, whatever. Then I'm gonna use my Catrice Glam and Doll False Lashes Mascara Waterproof. This one. Okay, now that mascara is done. I'm going to highlight my face. Just take a little bit of the Mary Luminizer by The Bomb Cosmetics and a small blush. I know that um, the blush kind of gives that glow, but girl needs a little bit of extra glow. Extra glow does not hurt anybody. Just gonna go over the cheeks with my beauty sponge just to mute everything out. Um, give a spritz of the NYX Cosmetics NYX Makeup Bear With Me setting spray. Douse myself with that. And then for lips, I will be using the Rare Beauty Lip Souffle in Fearless. It's like this dark mauve shade 
which I think is perfect for my skin tone. And it gives me a more natural lip color. Okay, once that's... And I have a little bit of a balm on. And that is it for today's look. This is how I do my everyday makeup. It's simple, it's easy, it takes me like 10-15 minutes to do. Um, if you guys enjoy it, please give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe, whatever. Okay, bye.